Hey guys, back out in my shop, and I wanted to address a couple of questions, uh, or actually a lot of questions that I've gotten recently. Uh, you know, people have gotten their, their plans and they're starting to uh, make some parts and they're thinking about software and, and, and everything. And I've had a bunch of people ask me about CAD programs, you know, uh, which is the best CAD program to use and all that. And there's really no... Uh, really good answer for that because you know if you if you're used to drawing in anything at all whether it be Corel draw or uh, AutoCAD light or TurboCAD or you know Google SketchUp any of those kinds of things if you're already used to drawing in some uh, some form of drawing program that's what you should stick with and and instead of trying to learn something new uh, if you haven't ever done any CAD or ha haven't ever drawn anything there's uh, two options that I would uh, try. I think if you know if it was me, and one would be to either download the uh, the Google SketchUp, which is free. Uh, they do have a, a pro version, which is uh, you pay for, but they also have the, the Google SketchUp uh, free version. And it's uh, you know I've seen a lot of guys uh, on YouTube that use that to draw their plans, and it, and it seems like pretty good stuff. I really can't tell you anything about it because, you know, I draw on something else, so uh, I've never used it. I, I did download a copy of it just to try to look at it and, and, and see, but I'd, I'd be absolutely no help whatsoever as far as somebody asking me a question about Google SketchUp because I, I just don't use it. Uh, but that's that's a good choice, I think, for somebody who's uh, wanting to learn how to draw something to be able to import it into their software uh, to create parts or you know, whatever it is you're making, whatever kind of project it is. Uh, the other option I think you might have is if you get some software like, uh, like this is uh, my version of VCar Pro here, and they do have, it's not just to program, uh, you know, you can import a drawing if you, if you do draw it in something else, but you don't have to. If you, if you don't know how to draw anyway, you might as well learn how to use their drawing tools uh, to draw uh, things, they do have you know you can put text and text on an arc and uh, you know just all kinds of things with this. And, and as you might have saw in the the, the video, I think a couple of videos again uh, ago when I was showing how to make the uh, the little router mount plate, I actually drew you know I did a 3D model of that part in some other software. But then when I brought it in here, I also needed to use this to change some lines to make the the dados and that kind of thing. So, uh, you know, if, if you if I didn't have already have some other CAD and was proficient in, in drawing it, I would learn how to use this probably. That would be my uh, best bet because that way I don't have to buy another CAD package. Uh, but I wanted to, I just want to talk about that a minute. I know I've had a lot of people say, hey, you know, what what kind of CAD program do I need? And uh, you know, it really doesn't matter. Any kind of CAD program will work if you're Again, if you're used to drawing in something, if you've used anything else at all, stick with that. And because the more you use it, the better you'll get at it. Um, if you're not, I'd go with either the drawing, uh, pro, uh, the drawing part of the program you're using uh, to, to program, whether it be VCar Pro or uh, you know any of the other ones. Um, and if not that, then I'd go with the Google SketchUp, which is probably uh, a really good choice because I know a lot. And, the, and by the way, I will say, uh, I'm, I'm going to go over to my buddy Jim's house today. He's the one that I gave that machine to. I want to show you the, the table that he made. But also, he's got the, uh, the newer version of eCar Pro. I haven't bought the update yet. Uh, I need to get that. But he bought the new uh, 7.5 of the eCar Pro. And it does have, one of the things that they changed in the new version is it does have where you can import from Google SketchUp. I guess they realized that that's a, a really popular drawing software now, so they needed to add that to where you can import from Google SketchUp straight into the vCard Pro. So I thought I would mention that. But anyway, I'm going to head over to my buddy Jim's house. I want to show you the table uh, clamping system that he's put on that, uh, that little machine. And we'll head over there now. Okay, I'm out here in my buddy Jim's shop, and you might recognize this is a machine I did the CNC router build on. But I want to take a minute to show you all the table he built. This is really nice. He took some three-quarter MDF, cut some rabbits on the side to go over the uh, 
the one inch angle here and then he used the uh, T-tracks from Rockler and put some dados in here and fasten those down and has it securely attached and it really makes a nice table. Uh, bought some Rockler clamps uh, similar to what I use on my machine and, it, and they work great. So he did a great job.